And that's why they say now in India, if you want to get a fortune in India, that on the cover it said, like a little bit like Batman, it said, be afraid. Yeah? So it says basically, be afraid, rocket internet is coming. Yeah? Something like that. Yeah? In India, yeah? India, fortune. And then you read the article and says, you know, a little romantic. Yeah? Uh, we were this little company in India and uh, we were selling the online fashion and then rocket internet came. And they did what we did in four years, and now they're five times bigger. Yeah? And then has picture of the food panda founders there, and of the rock, uh, of the, uh, the Jabong founders there, and so on and so on. And so basically, those guys, even if they had existing idea, even if they had uh, smart, etc., they missed the other two pieces, knowledge and capital. Yeah? So I think the, however you do that, however you do that, you need to think of those two because it's not a completely virgin territory anymore. Yeah? There are other gold miners, yeah? gold diggers. There are other people <laughs> kind of like going for the same market. Let it be us, let it be others, etc. It doesn't matter. But you need to have to have a great risk return ratio. You need to have that. If you do that, then basically I think there's a lot of opportunities, yeah? So, let's skip really fast here. So, I mean, that is clear, that is the scored page, yeah? All the opportunities, yeah? So, what's also, yeah, that we can go very fast, but basically, yeah? The phenomenon is just bigger than you think, and basically you just thought kind of like, okay, internet, etc. But, you know, it's still growing, growing, growing very much, yeah? So, and then the best part is, look at that, e-commerce penetration in, in, in the United States, in the UK, 87. In Brazil, 36. So why don't you go to Sao Paulo? Yeah? Why don't you go to Sao Paulo? Yeah? Why don't you go to Mexico City? Why don't you go to uh, Buenos Aires? Much better than Palma anyway. So, but that what means, do you think an entrepreneur is a comfortable life? Yeah, I sit in Germany and kind of like I stay 10 kilometers from my parents and always with the same girlfriend. Yeah, that's comfortable. <laughs> So, sorry, that is comfortable. Yes, I tell you, that's comfortable. That is comfortable. The different thing is, let's take, let's convince my girlfriend to even both go there, or let's convince my boyfriend to go there. Yeah? So, of course, going to McKinsey is more comfortable than becoming an entrepreneur. So, brave heart, look where he lived. He lived in the, in the dirt. Yeah? yeah, look at it. Have you just seen movies? Most of the time, dirty. Yeah? <laughs> there is this beautiful girl, I think this is a, uh, this uh, French Marceau or something. She lives in a big tent. Yeah? yeah, and the loser lives also in a big tent. Yeah? There you see already the beginning. Big offices tend to become losers. <laughs> McKinsey has very big offices. <laughs> um, meaning beautiful offices. If you're an entrepreneur, you're dirty, meaning you're not afraid to go. You're not afraid. You are not afraid to say goodbye to your parents. You're not afraid to say goodbye to McKinsey. You're not afraid to say goodbye to your friends. But you go to Indonesia and win a 270 million people country that's virgin territory. That will is now the fourth biggest country in the world. And that has, just reading the map, five times more opportunity than Germany. Huh? Be much more global. If there's one advantage that Germany has, it's definitely not the entrepreneurial culture. <laughs> but there's one advantage that we have, it's the export culture, the international, not being afraid to other countries. Uh, we are the smaller countries, so we have to get out and conquer the other countries. Yeah? The internet. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, I mean, what do you want? America has the entrepreneurial culture. Germany has the export culture. So, you have to go out. You have to live your comfortable life. That's what this slide tells me. Yeah, I mean, some of our team made it for the reason, but they say, you know, it's all, this is all yeah, university material. The main message, choose if you want to stay comfortable or not. Germany is a comfortable option. 